If you're like me and have multiple Google Calendars and an iPhone, you know that Apple's Calendar app doesn't show all of your Google Calendars by default. I have a plain bagel work calendar and personal calendar, but all you see is work. So I'm back in my calendar and I have my work and personal calendar and I want to sync both of those with my iPhone. So I come over to the gear and click sync with mobile device. This will load a Google help page and there's an option for sync Google Calendar with iOS device. Click it and I'm going to scroll down to the bottom where it has sync multiple calendars. And here is where you want to visit the following page from your device's mobile browser. And a lot of times what I do is just copy and paste this and then email it to myself. Okay, so I'm back on my phone. I have the email for myself. And I'm going to click on the link. I'll go ahead and sign in. After signing in, I have a place where I can choose the calendars that I want to sync. The one with the email address is typically the default calendar that came. But here is my plain bagel personal. So I'm going to go ahead and check it. Click Save. I'm going to switch to the calendar. I'm going to tap calendars. I'll scroll down to my Plain Bagel account, and now I have an option to turn on my Plain Bagel personal calendar.